Good morning, students. In the previous year, we have learned some simple geometrical figures like rectangle, square, triangle, circle, etc. In this year, we have to learn about perimeter and area of simple geometrical figures. Now, let's go to first perimeter. What is the meaning of perimeter and how to find out the perimeter? See here, one simple geometrical diagram is here. Here, A, B, C, D is a simple geometrical figure. For this, they give a measurements. Here, what is the distance from A to B? A to B is, A, B is 8 cm. Distance from B to C, B, C is equal to 6 cm. And distance from C to B is, C, D is equal to 7 cm. Distance from D to A, D, A is 4 cm. Now, what is the total length of this shape boundary? This is the boundary of this geometrical shape. What is the total length? So, how to find out the total length? AB plus BC plus CD plus DA. What is the length of the AB? 8 cm and 6 cm. BC is 6 cm plus CD is 7 cm. Here DA is DA is 4 cm. Here to add all these sides. 8 plus 6 is 14. 14 plus 7 21. 21 plus 4 25 cm. What is this 4? Uh, 25 cm. That is uh, called as perimeter. Perimeter means total measurement of the boundary. Boundary of the this figure. Means the sum of total length of all all the sides of a geometrical figure. What is the perimeter? Sum of total length of all sides of a geometrical figure. Let's go to the means. That is find out the how to find out the perimeter of a given shape. Now here we give a triangle. For triangle how many sides? There are three sides. That is A, A, B, B, C, C, A are the three sides. Now they give a three sides and the measurement also they give a. Now we have to find out the perimeter. How to find out the perimeter? Now A, B, perimeter is equal to A, B plus B, C plus C. What is the length of AB? It is 4 cm plus BC is 7 cm plus CA is 6 cm. Then add all these three sides. 4 plus 7 is 11. 11 plus 6 17 cm. What is the perimeter of this triangle? That is 17 cm. We we'll go to next sum. That is rectangle shape. That is for rectangle there are four sides. That is opposite sides are equal. You see AB is a 5 cm. DC also 5 cm. Then AD and BC are equal. Opposite sides are equal in rectangle. Here how to find out the perimeter. Perimeter is equal to. Here four sides are there. AB plus BC plus CD. Plus DA. What is the length of AB? AB is 5 cm. Plus BC is 2 cm. Plus CD is 5 cm. Plus DA is 2 cm. Let's add all these 4 sides. 5 plus 2 is 7. 7 plus 5 is 12. 12 plus 2 is 14. 14 cm. Perimeter of this uh, rectangle is 14 cm. Here next to me is excluding one side, other two sides are they given. Means one side is they not given and two sides are they given and perimeter also they given. That is a 15 cm. Here how to find out remaining side. Here they did not given on that side you have to find out. What is the perimeter? How to find out perimeter? Other side, perimeter is equal to 
AB plus BC plus CA. What is the measurement of AB? AB is 5 centimeter they give one. Plus BC also they give one. That is 6 centimeter. CA is you have to find out. They not give one. CA. Perimeter how much they give? That is a 15 centimeter. Now you have to find out CA. Now, 15 centimeter is equal to 5 plus 6 11. 11 centimeter plus C. CA is equal to 15 centimeter. You have to bring this 11 to this side. It will sign will change. Minus 11 centimeter. 15 minus 11. That is a 4 centimeter. What is the measurement of CA is? CA is 4 centimeter. Means if you add 3 sides, we will get 15 centimeter. 6 plus 5, 11. 11 plus 4. What we got here? 4 centimeter. 4, 5 plus 5, 6 plus 5, 11. 11 plus 4, 15 centimeter. Next, we will go to next sum. That is the rectangle shape. We are also 3 sides they give one. And one more side they not give one. That one we have to find out. Then P. Perimeter is equal to PQ plus PR plus RS plus QSQ. That to find out. Perimeter how much they give? 24 centimeter. What is the perimeter here? 24 centimeter. PQ what is the measurement of PQ? 10 centimeter. PR is 2 cm, RS 5, 10 cm plus SQ. SQ you don't know, you have to find out that one. Now you have to add all these. 24 cm is equal to 10 plus 2, 12. 12 plus 2, 22. 22 plus SQ. Now SQ is equal to 24 minus 22 that is 2 cm. Here what is the measurement of QF that is 2 cm. That is if you add all these 4 sides you will get 24 cm. I hope you are all understood. Thank you.